good afternoon everyone, my name is May and I'm representative of Group 2 to be in charge of the first workshop. And as we know, marketing is just like a cake and advertising via digital marketing are small pieces of that cake. So now I will uh, talk, uh, so now I will take a part of it and talk about advertising strategy. So. As you may know, uh, you may not know, advertising is uh, create is creating pet annou uh, announcement and that would be promoted and advertised on many kind of media like TV, our phone, uh, radio, online, or uh, something like that. And when you see an advertisement and you remember it and you change your behavior for it, uh, it means that your advertising strategy is successful. So an advertising strategy is a plan to reach and persuade customer with many different objectives like indirect selling, delivering the message or idea of your product or service to the customer, or any other objective like building brand or achieve uh, other reasonable goals. Uh, so now I will uh, so now I will introduce the flow of an advertising strategy. Here I list six steps. Uh, the first step receiving a clear brief from clients, uh, which means uh, we use we, we used to know from the first topic uh, presented by group one. So I will start by uh, with the second step, define the product service. Next is understanding your TA means you need to know who is your target audience. Um, we make a small market research and then we move to the, an important step that is develop a successful advertising campaign based on these factor and uh, actually this is 5M message media uh, budget which means uh, budget money, uh, major, major, major measurement and uh, the last M is mission, uh, and then the last step is modify advertising strategy time to time. So as I said, we're gonna start with step two. Uh, step two is define product and service. So the purpose of this step is to specify the object that offered by the company. Like when you re receive the brief from client, you need to know. Uh, what you gonna do? What uh, is that a product or service like? Uh, you receive a, a brief uh, from brand comfort, but it's uh, you will do the product like that comfort nature. So you have to define what is your specific specific your object, and the objective or the goal uh, of the product needs to be clear. Uh, like determ determine primary objective of the product service. It could be selling product as segment X, uh, segment maybe a young young uh, target audience or something like that. Um, the, the next step is un to understand your target audience based on four factors we already know like geographic, whether they live in the north, south or center, uh, demographic, uh, like uh, what is the age, gender, uh, behavior, like interest, or um, and psychographics. Um, the next step is market research. We need to make a market research to see that um, what uh, is that your product already in the market or not, or uh, how big is the market for that product or where you in the market do you have any uh, competitor like if you do a campaign for Milo you need to know that its biggest competitor are of, is Ovaltine and we need to know the barrier of uh, customer life what are the problem uh, in getting the product service why they don't buy that product or uh, do they have any explanation, uh, complaination about that and expectation what customer decide for that product, what they want more from your product or service. After we make a research and we find your our target audience, uh, it's time to develop an advertising strategy. And normally a campaign will have three phases and they are mixed 
uh, then they are made based on customer buying behavior or customer buying process. Uh, move the, we move them from organic, which means they don't have anything, they don't have any uh, information about your product or service, then we move them to comprehension, conviction, to action. We make them uh, believe, um, think about our message we want to give them. So uh, this is an overview of a campaign, like I said. It, a campaign will have three phases. Phase. The first phase is a planet, in which means we create a meaningful mes message uh, and which deliver the benefits you provide to customer and what makes you different from competitor. And this is the time customer aware of your product. Um, the second phase is the most important phase is influence. Uh, we need to make a connection between you and your customer based on French engagement. We increase interaction or experience of customer with the product or service. And the final phase is amplify like uh, they already know about your product, they already know about the message or idea you give them. So it's time to call the action like uh, you call for sale or you call for they do something together. Um, it's time to, for you to make a report for what you have done in uh, the last two phase. To design a successful campaign, five M theory should be delivered and manipulated clearly. And what are these five M? First, a mission. Uh, be careful. This is the mission of a campaign, not the mission of the brand or product. Uh, there are three kind of uh, mission in a campaign. The first one, uh, campaign with informative mission, is for new product or service or the existing product service. Uh, but uh, they add in the new uh, function. So the, the this this product is to inform the customer uh, the editing of. Uh, the second type of campaign is persuasive campaign. This is for existing, existing products or service, which customers already know about it, but they haven't changed their behavior or thought to buy it. Uh, and we have to make a result I said to find uh, what is the barrier in getting those products. And the final uh, mission campaign is for long life product service. This time, campaign mission just reminds customer not to forget and increase engagement. Like Henneken, um, uh, they're already famous, right? But um, they still do advertisement because they want customer to remember them. Uh, the second M is message. Uh, a campaign, uh, a successful campaign, it make, uh, it make from a successful method, and we have to make a message, a creative message or idea that will generate a widespread strong effect, and they have will have a strong uh, effect to our com to the whole community, and the customer will re will remember your message. And to how to create a strong message or idea, we need to be find and find and find out three different terms. First a customer inside when uh, it can be seen as a customer problem. Uh, like uh, this one customer might know or they might not they might even not know their problem is after finding the customer inside the big idea is uh, our responsibility. We need to understand customers so well to find the idea for that problem. And the finally is um, we have we already have a big idea. We will make a campaign and we will um, summarize our campaign in a tagline. Tagline is a very soft slogan that generate the whole campaign of us. Uh, and a message should be meaningful, unique, unique. Uh, emotional and creative and it should be delivered to customer under a tagline or slogan like we tell have um phi công nghệ tiến lên phía trước sẽ không ai bị bỏ lại phía sau yeah uh, next is next m in media touch board there are many kind of media like i talk, talk with you in the first slide and 
uh, like TV, newspaper, magazine, direct mail, uh, and so on. And each media will uh, will have the affection to each different target audience. So we need to find uh, how much time uh, our TI spend for that media. Uh, the total time our advertisement our, our advertisement should be appear on that platform and how much it can be reached and by what method. So the objective of this aim is to uh, financial efficiency and reach our target audience effectively. So we can um, make sure that everyone can uh, know about our message or idea. Uh, the fourth aim is money or bucket. Uh, depend on budgets that client will give to agency or company gives to in-house team. In-house team, it means um, the the marketing team inside the brand company. Uh, they will decide a detailed quotation which mark the given budget. Like uh, your TI is teenager, you want to reach them by uh, TV or television, but the client just give you a small budget, so you have to consider to choose between uh, what social media. Uh, how many advertisements or uh, how long for the advertisement you would advertise in that platform. And the final aim to make a successful campaign is just measurement. To assess the effectiveness of advertising campaign, you can uh, have um, many different kinds of measurement like money to sell, customer or the traffic of customer to the store or click to rate. Uh, simply just in great engagement or interaction of customer in uh, so in the social media platform. And uh, and the last step and the last step of the cam of the whole cam advertising campaign is that modify advertising strategy. And this step we have to be careful because uh, we have to update news new trends every day. Uh, we have to stay in touch with the strength in marketing and modify advertising strategy time to time uh, and it will make the customer in interest about it. Uh, now we make a research uh, now we make a research a real research on a case study like the campaign for real building. Uh, this is uh, the campaign Dove made and it very very successful like no matter who you are, no matter the um, color of your skin is, no matter uh, how you look like um, so uh, human have highly value on physical appearance and um, and this campaign is to increase the human self esteem, happiness and overall well-being uh, because they find that less women because they find that women are lack of confidence in their physical appearance so uh, they they do this campaign to encourage your uh, their the the woman um, spirit uh, the two important thing make an advertising strategy successful in message and media so now I will uh, go deeper in the message and media of the campaign. The message of the campaign we go through two phase, phase one and phase two. Phase one is we need to make them aware of uh, what our campaign is about. Uh, so those uh, enhance customer self-confidence by a product component of real beauty including not only physical attractiveness but also the happiness kindness, wise wisdom, dignity, love, authenticity, and self-realization. Like they want to say with women that um, they want they want to say with women that uh, beauty or happiness come from all self and sight. And phase two, they uh, and phase two, they uh, they want to make a connection between customer, woman, and two. Uh, the brand like they directly challenge the stereotypical uh, assumption that only teen is beautiful and they want to make change in human thoughts and behavior so the, the message uh, they want to send to all the women out there is that no wonder our perception of beauty is 
uh, is started. Uh, talk to your daughter uh, before the before the beauty industry door and send to you by someone who thinks you are beautiful. Uh, and they use many platform of media like in 2004 they launched a series of advertisement uh, to bring us to a lot of bus stop in many different states like New York, Chicago, DC, LIR, urban market and um, the result is that the profit of the advertisement is increased dramatically and the sale goes up so uh, this is the end of my uh, presentation. Thank you for watching and um, have a nice day.